Hello and welcome to this video on the Upstream Project Management Plugin for WordPress. I'm going to be talking about the Customizer extension, which adds some extra features to Upstream. The Customizer extension allows you to add your own logos and your own brand colors to the projects area of Upstream, which is what your clients and your customers will see. The Customizer extension allows you to make Upstream look like something developed by your team. It allows you to white label the front end of Upstream. Let me show you an example. In the top left corner, you'll see the site title is My Upstream Demo. Now, you can replace that with your own logo to make it look more like your own product. If you go to the admin area of your Upstream site and you have the customizer extension installed, you go to the Upstream link in the menu and then Customizer. And the very first setting you'll see is logo. You'll be able to choose a new logo for the front end of your upstream site. Click on add or upload file, and you'll be taken to the WordPress media manager where you can access any of the images you've uploaded. I've uploaded my upstream logo earlier. So I'm going to select that, click use this file, and the logo is now ready for use. There's a default width and height, but I could change that if need be. Scroll to the bottom, click on save. And if we go back to the front end of Upstream, you'll see that the site title has been replaced with my new logo. That looks a lot better. Let me show you a second example of how the customizer works. We're looking at the normal default design of Upstream with the exception of the logo in the top left corner. If I go to the admin, I'm going to see underneath the logo, lots of areas where I can change the colors of different parts of the site. For example, I can change the heading color. This is what we're looking at at the moment. Everything in the text is a fairly standard dark gray or black color. In the heading text color, I can choose purple. It may be that my brand requires purple. If I click save after choosing purple for the headings and refresh the front end of Upstream, all of the major headings are now shown in purple. Let's take a look at another color customization. If you scroll down a little further, you'll see that the tasks area and other areas in Upstream have a button on the top right corner of each area. This is going to be used often to add a project, to add a milestone, to add a task, to add key elements to a project. You can customize the color of this button by going to the upstream admin and scrolling down. We're looking for the primary buttons area and the background color option. In this case, I could choose yellow or perhaps green. And if I scroll down and click on save, my green color will be saved. And if I refresh the front of Upstream, those buttons are now the green color that I chose. Let's see a third and final example of how to use the customizer in this brief introduction. In addition to the basic Upstream features we've looked at so far, it's also possible to use the customizer to change the color of some other upstream extensions. One example is the calendar view. Now, this is an extra extension which allows you to see all the tasks and bugs and milestones on your site, organized according to their start date and end date. You can see it in a calendar view that you can switch to a, a weekly or a monthly view or even a single day view. And you can change the color of different parts of the calendar. One example is you may want to distinguish between weekdays and weekends. Maybe your team doesn't work on weekends. If you go to the upstream customizer settings and you scroll down, you'll see down towards the bottom, there are actually color settings for the calendar view extension. And one of them is the ability to have different colors for weekdays and weekend days. In this example, I'm going to change the background color for weekends so that people are easily able to see 
if any start dates or end dates are scheduled for Saturday or Sunday. I'm going to change that to an orange background. I'm going to scroll down, click on save. Go back to the front end of Upstream and you'll notice that in the calendar view, the weekend days now have a very distinctive orange background. Now, I've used some slightly over-the-top colors so it's easy to see on this demo, but hopefully I've explained how the customizer can allow you to tweak Upstream to make it look as if it's something that you designed yourself and something that's a natural fit for your company. You can use the customizer extension to white label Upstream to make it look like your product. So, if you haven't tried it yet, I highly recommend trying the customizer extension to improve your WordPress project management with Upstream.